because of COVID, I was a, if you look in boxing terms, I was a lightweight, and then I moved to being a middleweight. <laughs> I do hope that through the use of the boxing ring, I will be back to being a lightweight very soon. <laughs> That's one convert to boxing who sees the role sport can play in the development of more than just individuals, but the nation as a whole, hence is pushed to make this arrangement a success. The cache of boxing equipment donated by the board is an exhaustive list, including a spanking new ring, which helps solidify a partnership started some time ago. Community-based sporting initiatives, like our boxing development program, offer much more than technical instruction in the sport of boxing. Many of the athletes who completed this initiative have gained life enhancement skills that would aid in their holistic development. While the TBBC is primarily charged with regulating the sport of boxing, the board believes that champions will rise from the ranks as a result of exposing more young people to boxing. They have also thrown in certification of 34 coaches, 13 referees and judges, as well as a timekeeper, all music to the minister's air. Today's event bodes well for the development of this sport in Trinidad and Tobago. I am pleased that the Boxing Board of Control has developed a strategic plan and a very central part of that strategic plan is community development and offering assistance to groups within the communities. The equipment is to be positioned at the Aruka Police Station. Ruskin Mark, TDT Sports.